The Riftbreaker is a base-building strategy game with elements of hack and slash, survival and exploration. We are very excited to announce that The Riftbreaker will be available in Xbox Game Pass from day one on PC and the Xbox Series X and Series S consoles. You play the role of Captain Ashley S. Novak. You are the Riftbreaker, an elite scientist slash commando inside a powerful mecha suit. Enter a one-way portal to Galatea 37, a distant planet at the far reaches of the Milky Way galaxy, with the purpose of building up a base that will allow travel back to Earth and further colonization. Ashley's mecha suit, which she calls Mr. Riggs, can withstand the harshest environmental conditions and has a full range of equipment for base construction, resource extraction, gathering specimens and, of course, combat. It is capable of traveling through rifts that connect space across vast distances. No one knows exactly what lies beyond a rift portal. Locations for jumps are determined by long-range scans. It is known that the planets that they lead to are usually habitable, but apart from that, rift breakers have to be ready for everything in order to survive and complete their mission. Galatea 37 is rich in natural resources that you can use to construct all the buildings you need. As you expand your base, you will have to expand your economy. Soon, you will transform your landing area into a bustling system of interconnected facilities working towards your mission goal. That interferes with the natural order of the planet in a significant way. The indigenous creatures inhabiting the planet will do whatever it takes to destroy you. Galatea 37 is inhabited by various species of creatures unlike anything on Earth. Ranging from small dog-like canopteryx to gnerots, living rocks that feed on minerals, you will have plenty of interesting creatures to conduct your research on. You can scan and collect samples of each creature you find in the wild to unlock more technologies that you can use to your benefit. Galatean creatures will become increasingly hostile with each day you spend on their home world. In order to protect yourself and your base, you will need to work on your defenses. Luckily, there is no shortage of weapons in the Riftbreaker arsenal. You can take the fight to the native creatures by using a wide range of craftable weapons. Each piece of equipment you craft gets a randomized set of features. No two weapons are ever the same. You can modify them even further by installing weapon mods you find along the way. If you prefer a more defensive approach, surround your base with walls and deploy a wide range of towers to protect your base. Depending on the kind of threat that you want to protect yourself from, you can choose from lasers, plasma, flamethrowers, miniguns or even nuclear artillery. In order to get the resources necessary to build all those wonders of technology, you will have to scout the planet a little bit. During the Riftbreaker's story campaign, you will visit four biomes, each with entirely different fauna and flora, as well as weather conditions. You will face a unique set of challenges in each of the biomes. The world of the Riftbreaker lives. Neutral creatures wander about, grazing on the plains. Tall trees and grass sway to the wind. The plants you cut down regrow over time. It's all accompanied by a dynamic day and night system, making the world of Galatea 37 truly immersive. As beautiful as this planet is, Galatea 37 is not a safe place for humans, or at least not yet. High frequency emissions from all your machinery are like a beacon for hordes of alien creatures who will come to you time and again to destroy you. You will need to make use of all your gear and keep your infrastructure in top shape in order to survive. The battles will be fierce, often spanning various points across the map and featuring thousands of enemies at once. The Riftbreaker runs on XR Studio's proprietary game engine called the Schmetterling. The latest version of the engine utilizes an entire range of DirectX 12 Ultimate features that will be right at home on the Xbox Series X and Series S. 
Soft Shadows and the Rift Breaker utilize real-time ray tracing. Thanks to this technique, shadows are always accurate and detailed, even in the most complex areas. The dynamic night and day system also benefits from this, giving the world of Galatea 37 a natural look. Thanks to ray traced soft shadows, any shadow casting lights add to the game scene result in realistic and visually pleasing spectacles of light and shadow. You can observe them every time you jump out of a rift portal, when a stray comet passes over your head, and in many more, slightly less obvious situations. Ray traced soft shadows are accompanied by ray traced ambient occlusion. Thanks to RTAO, we can simulate the behavior of diffuse lighting on the scene, allowing us to give the Rift Breaker a more detailed look. Apart from enjoying all the technical benefits of your new hardware, you will be able to play the Rift Breaker on Xbox Series consoles by either using a gamepad or by plugging in your USB mouse and keyboard straight into the console. We can't wait to let you explore the vast alien world of Galatea 37 and allow you to uncover its secrets in the story-based campaign mode, as well as in the adrenaline-pumping survival mode. Whichever mode you choose, whether you play on Xbox or on the PC, the Rift Breaker will greet you with smooth gameplay, high-fidelity graphics, hordes of enemy creatures, and even more explosions. The Rift Breaker. Play it day one with Xbox Game Pass on Series X, Series S, Windows 10 PCs and Cloud.